So this is us here in the United States. And this is what's going to happen to the virus if we don't do anything. It'll start out with a few cases, then we get on the steep part of the curve, and then it peaks, and then naturally the virus has a tendency to come down. So we are right over here in Colorado, where the cases have started to pick up, but we're not in the steep part yet. So what we really want to try to do, and I'm going to model this in a blue over here, is to change the course of this curve. So since we're here right now, what we would like to see instead is for this to happen. And this can happen with something called social distancing. So let's talk a little bit about social distancing. Distance. So social distancing is essentially changing your behavior so that you're avoiding situations where you have mass transmission of the virus or events that we call super spreading events. And these are going on cruise ships, these are going to large crowded public places like big medical conferences or other conferences like South by Southwest. This is going to large sporting events. It's starting to change your behavior so that we never really get to the steep part of the curve. And this right here, I would say, is our window. Because once we get onto the steep part of the curve, social distancing becomes less effective Why because is that? because the virus is replicating and spreading so rapidly. So so many people have already been infected that the likelihood that social distancing will be able to flatten the curve significantly is less. You could still probably get some flattening, but it won't happen to the extent that it would if we started to change some of our behaviors now. So what's really nice about this, when I saw this graph, what struck me was that my behavior actually changes the way the virus behaves. So if I continue to do what I'm doing, and nobody does anything different, nobody washes their hands, people continue to interact with each other closely, the virus is going to take its course. But if I make some small changes in my behavior now, it's going to lead to a whole different outcome, not just for me, but for our entire community.